I have long believed that the climate crisis is the most important challenge facing humanity. 11 years ago, when I came here to Cannes, I watched how this extraordinary film festival in many ways launched the modern climate movement. Now, 11 years later, we see that the crisis is even worse than predicted, but one of the great changes is that now we have the solutions because solar and wind and electric vehicles and other new technologies have come down so rapidly in price that we can solve the crisis. It is a time for action. People uh, have to make demands on political leaders to solve this crisis. Donald Trump has been blocked by our courts and the Congress has refused to go along with some of his proposals. But I am still hopeful that he will decide to stay in the Paris Agreement. No one person can stop the climate movement. Businesses are now playing a leadership role. Many have committed to 100% renewable energy, and people are becoming involved. The climate crisis uh, we now confront is similar to other challenges in our past. The abolition of slavery, the women's rights movement, more recently the gay rights movement. All of these movements have faced uh, obstacles, but each of these previous movements have reached a tipping point when people began to see clearly that the choice is really between right and wrong. I think the message of this movie is that a truth can be a source of power for all of us. And all of us as human beings ha have the ability to bring change in the world. The late Nelson Mandela once said, it's always impossible until it's done we now see the, the beginnings of an historic change. We are seeing people awaken to the tremendous crisis we face, and now we see them awakening to the fact that the solutions are available. All we need to do is implement them quickly. Speech.